Pilot Spec 2013 contains a number of enhancements to the point cloud functionality. Improvements to the display in the pick points alignment make it easier to use. When you create a pick points alignment, the first step is to synchronize the views of the CAD model and the point cloud. Then you create matched pairs of points by selecting target regions in the point cloud data and placing corresponding datum targets on the CAD model, or vice versa. The order is flexible, so PowerInspect now highlights the unmatched target region or datum target in a different color. This allows you to see at a glance which points you still need to match. When the alignment is complete, the point cloud is automatically projected against the CAD model, allowing you to see the deviations at a glance with a color-coded display. You can also highlight the deviations of individual points using the point labeling function. Use this feature to select the points or regions that you need and PowerInspect will add the labels to the graphics window. You can then print these images or add them to your reports. A further improvement is included for situations when you need to inspect a batch of similar components. Use the new measure function to repeat the measurement sequence for another similar part. PowerInspect creates a new measure with an identical sequence tree. It contains all the same features with the same nominal values, but with space for the measured values from the new component. Select Play All to carry out the measurement. PowerInspect will guide you through the measurement process. You measure the sequence for the new part in just the same way as you did for the first one. The selected point cloud labels are recreated for the new part, meaning that your inspection and report views are automatically recreated when you complete the measurement. This saves time and improves consistency when you measure a batch of similar components. It also makes it easier for multiple operators to measure a batch of parts.